project lens, guys. It's Wednesday. Here's where my intro would be if I had one! Make me an intro. I'd be your bestest friend ever. So I'm having a bad day. <laughs> oh! It's one of those days. Let's see. Hmm. Okay. Well, first of all, I went to get dressed and had one of those days where you try on like 47 different outfits and you hate every single one you feel fat and ugly. And then, I couldn't find my camera or my keys. So, I was late to work. Oh yeah, other reason I was late to work um, that compounded it was the fact that I took a wrong turn off an exit that I have never taken before. I, I worked here for two years. What the hell? I came to work and found out the two people I'm really close to at work were laid off. I brought hummus and crackers for my breakfast this morning and the hummus burst all over my bag and my lunch. Listen to me. I know my day could be worse, but I'm mildly annoyed right now. On to bigger and better things. Let's get over this. Okay. Determined to have a good day. Make good choices, right? Um, some things to talk about. If you haven't seen the show Drop Dead Diva, you should go watch it. I'm not saying I thought of... Now I'm burping randomly. I'm not saying it's the best show ever on television. I don't really watch any scripted TV. Grey's Anatomy, maybe. Maybe that South Park, like that's it. But, um... It wasn't bad, but it still bugged me because the character is a plus size woman, but the soul or the personality inside her is a dead woman who was 24 and really skinny. I was a little disappointed that the one episode I happened to watch happened to be about weight loss. <laughs> Ugh. I don't know. I don't know. Watch it? Don't watch it? I don't know. Promise. I'm sure you don't care about this, but I'm very excited that my brother's coming to visit. I haven't seen him or my sister-in-law since my dad died a couple years ago. So, it's kind of epic that he's coming to Tucson. I like my brother. I don't know how you all, like, what kind of relationships you have with your siblings. But it's kind of strange and difficult to maintain a friend friendship um, as adults. I don't know why. We just have different lives. Maybe it'd be different if we were sisters. I don't know. What about you? Do you have brothers? This is my brother. Oh, yeah. He's not a singer. He's kind of kick ass. Um, what else is going on? Oh, have you seen Dating in the Dark? If you have not seen it, I don't know that I should say you should go see it. It's fascinating. Seriously. I think the most disturbing thing was when this guy felt up, like, you know, felt her waist, and, and she was like a size six, and he's like, mm. she's on the thicker side. That might be a deal breaker. <laughs> Woo! Put me in there, baby. I'll rock their world. And I talked to Crystal. I talked to her. She was in a like an internet cafe kind of thing somewhere in Africa, and she was waiting for some kind of transportation to Rwanda. And she's excited to come home, and she misses all of you. And we should have her home in a couple weeks. I'm so excited about that. We miss her. All right, I'm gonna sit here and eat my spilt hummus. All right. Have a great week. I'm going to try and have a great rest of my day. Um, happy birthday, Project Love Size. I guess we're going to talk about that more next week. It's also my birthday next week.